But we begin tonight with today's storm that drenched the Golden Empire. But heavier rain and strong winds are still on the way. 17's Karen Wah joining us now with some safety tips as you navigate the slick roads out there. Karen? The rain has been a welcome and refreshing sight for most, but it calls for caution when driving. After a dry six months, it's great. Locals are happy to finally see measurable rain. We don't get much here, so it just, everyone freaks out. On the roads. That oil is still there. It's going to rise to the surface. It's going to become very, very slippery. The perfect recipe for hydroplaning. Just one twelfth of an inch of rain while going 35 miles an hour is enough to hydroplane. If you do find yourself sliding on wet roads, let your foot off the gas pedal slowly. Steer straight until you regain control. And if your car starts spinning, turn the wheel slowly in the direction of the spin. Don't input too much steering and don't slam on your brakes. As for flooding, remember, turn around, don't drown. According to the U.S. Department of Transportation, nearly 5,000 people are killed and more than 400,000 people are injured in weather-related crashes each year. CHP officer Robert Rodriguez said, fortunately, there was not a spike in car accidents Wednesday in Kern County. One vehicle did roll over as the rain began to fall, but he says it hasn't been determined if weather was a contributing factor. Especially on rainy days, anticipate that there will be these, uh, these crashes which will uh, hinder your commute. So uh, again, allow yourself plenty of extra time. So the two main takeaways, slow down. Your braking ability will also change with the wet roadways. And um, also when you have your windshield wipers on, we want you to also activate those headlights. So if you have those daytime running lamps, that's not sufficient. For up to the minute road conditions, call Cal Caltrans at 1-800-GAS-ROAD. I'm Hiren Hua, 17 News.